We're here in the doghouse of Redco Rig 8. This is where the driller spends a lot of his time. This is his report sheet. Writes down his 12-hour shift, exactly what he does every hour and what the rig's doing. Um, it's got all your information about what kind of BHA or a bottom hole assembly you've got in the hole from bits to drill collars to drill string and what depth they're at. You got a bit, a bits of drill collars, the jar, and then drill pipe. And it'll tell you exactly how long that bottom hole assembly is. 502.86 feet and then drill pipe behind it. What they're going to log here is time from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m. So from 6 p.m. last night to 11 p.m. they were drilling. They did a rig service and they continued drilling. They keep it manually. They also keep it on computer. The manual is sometimes a good double check for the computer and vice versa. The computer he's got here, he's going to monitor lots of different stuff with this computer. He's going to monitor the RPMs, how fast that bit's turning. He's going to measure the weight on the bit and see how much weight he's putting on the bit. He's going to see how fast it's drilling. The strokes per minute, how many strokes the mud pumps are going, so how much mud and total volume he's pumping every minute. The standpipe pressure, what the pressure of the mud system is in, in the standpipe here. These are all the things that he watches. These have alarms on them. If anything gets out of a certain range that he sets, an alarm will go off and alert him that he needs to pay attention to what he's drilling. Right here, this is the auto driller. With this button right here, he can adjust the amount of weight on the bit that the rig will put on it automatically while it's drilling. Um, this way he doesn't have to stand out there with his hand on the rig handle constantly drilling the well. The rig does a lot of the work for him. The other big use of this room is rest and relaxation. People might think drilling's really fun and pretty exciting. It's really not. Um, currently we're drilling about six foot an hour. We drill 30 feet at a time, so it's going to be five hours between times when they have to add a new piece of pipe in. Adding a new joint of pipe only takes two to four minutes. So you got five hours of downtime for two to four minutes worth of work. It gives these guys a lot of time to clean the rig, paint it, that's why the rig looks so nice. They also spend a lot of time in here drinking coffee and eating junk food. Um, pretty good two staples on a rig are uh, hot dogs and coffee, and they usually have a lot of them. This doghouse is kind of like the locker room um, in a sports analogy. This is where the team kind of meets every morning or every evening. They come here first, they have their safety meetings here, they eat their meals here, they do a lot of their drilling here. There's an air conditioner in the summer and there's a heater in the winter. Um, this is their home away from home and they spend a lot of time here on the rig. And that, those are the basic purposes of a doghouse.